Welcome back, this is Dr. Jin Sung, where clinical excellence meets excellent results. Today we're going to talk about the blue zone, where the oldest populations tend to live. Let's get right into it. The greatest percentage of centenarians live in these areas, meaning they're older than 100 years old. Loma Linda, California, Nicoya, Costa Rica, Sardinia, Italy, Ikaria, Greece, Okinawa, Japan. Some commonalities here. They're pretty close to the ocean, about 60 miles away. And then uh, Loma Linda is very close to Bear Mountain, where you can go hiking in, in the mountains. Nicoya, Costa Rica is a peninsula, very close to the ocean. Sardinia, Ikaria, Okinawa, they're all islands. All these places tend to have mild to warm temperature, so there are some commonalities there. Okay. Let's get into some of the common factors. In this blue zone, they call it the power nine. Nine commonalities that they see uh, in these regions that contribute to longevity. One is natural movement. The ability to walk, move, garden, and do things around the house more manually than using a machine. So natural movement is one factor. Number two, sense of purpose. They usually get up with a sense of purpose. What do I need to do for the day? So they have uh, ideas and things that they want to do when they get up in the morning. Stress management, very crucial. The ability to meet with friends and take a nap and so forth. Okay. Number four, the 80% rule. The 80% rule is they eat to the point they're 80% full. They don't overeat or uh, participate in gluttonous uh, acts, basically stuffing themselves. So they use the 80% rule. They don't overeat and they tend not to eat uh, after dinner. Number five is plant-centric diet. They tend to have fresh fruits and veggies, and um, they eat maybe meat or animal products uh, one to two times per week rather than every single day. Number six, wine. They'll have one to two glasses of wine on a daily basis, and that seems to contribute to the longevity. Wine has resveratrol, but also will increase blood flow uh, opening up and dilating the blood vessels. So wine has a, a, a profound effect on a lot of patients. Spirituality. They tend to go to some sort of spiritual meeting once a week. And it's shown that people who do that tend to increase longevity up to about 14 years. That's quite a bit. Family first attitude. Uh, they tend to live with other family members or their children. So grandparents and parents will live with their children or, or, or the, the younger um, second generation, third generation might take care of their grandparents. So they all live in a very social family first network. They also have a very strong social network. The ability to go out and meet their friends um, on a daily basis to do things together or have a purpose uh, together. So those are the nine factors that contribute to longevity in the blue zone. Okay? The, the, the temper temperatures, um, along with the ability to be close to the ocean and the mountains, also tend to help. I bet there's another factor here is that these patients or these um, centenarians probably go to sleep around the same time and wake up at the same time. So they get quality sleep from a certain number of hours per day. I think that's another probably contributing factor not mentioned in the power nine. Okay, my name is Dr. Jin Sung, where clinical excellence meets excellent results. And we'll see you guys next week on the healthy side. Have an awesome day.